just going to give you a very, very brief overview of the conference so you know what it's about. And, um, yeah, uh, make sure that uh, this screen... Uh, yeah, by the way, we have uh, some filming going on. Um, so if anybody doesn't want to be filmed, you know, please, please let us know. Um, but the idea is that we will make this available uh, on YouTube at some point uh, in, the, in the future when we've edited all the materials together. Okay, so um, I'm about to introduce our first set of speakers. I'll do that when, um, when the time comes. But then looking ahead, uh, we're going to have lunch. Um, and during lunch, we welcome uh, Bluebot which is a little robot, chess robot, which is going to be running around on the, uh, the front of the stage here. And this is uh, uh, coming from <coughs> um, Boris Raquet uh, from France, so we're looking forward to that. Um, and then immediately from two o'clock, <coughs> we're having the World Cafe debates in this room here. Uh, so what you do is you choose two debates. You go to one, uh, and there is a host at that debate, and that person will um, engage in discussions with you. And then after half an hour or so, you switch to a different debate and you pick up on where the previous ones left. We have found this to be a very productive and uh, entertaining session. Then in the afternoons, we're running through some workshops. <coughs> and again, uh, although there, there are names on these workshops and chairs of these workshops, the idea is that everybody should be able to participates and uh, you know don't don't hold back you know just make your uh, uh, interests and um, your questions known um, <coughs> in keeping with these things <coughs> as, <coughs> um, we have s multiple simultaneous events so also this afternoon at the same time <coughs> as we have these workshops we, we, we also have a um, an event which is sponsored by Erasmus plus which is the um, uh, European Education Institution, which funds kind of strategic projects. And they funded a project for chess and mathematics in primary schools. <coughs> and um, that is a project where, which will be giving a kind of um, latest update report uh, uh, up in the mezzanine room upstairs. And uh, we will be, uh, the partners in that will be, will be present with some interesting discussions. Um, <coughs> Then uh, tomorrow, I won't say too much about tomorrow, um, but, I, but I, I will say um, that in the afternoon as well, we have some uh, software that's being demonstrated in, in room two. It's in the program, and it's a terribly exciting uh, age that we're living in. We've just heard about um, <coughs> Alpha Zero, and we're, we're looking at some fantastic um, software that's, that's coming out of uh, different parts of uh, the world. So, um, without further ado, I'd like to in introduce you to our first speaker. Um, so, <coughs> just to uh, bring this bring this up. Yeah. Okay. So, just a, a word about the topic. The topic is. Uh, the future of chess and education. So being logical type of people, we say, well, we can't really talk about the future of chess in education unless we know about the future of education. So who do we talk to about the future of education? Do we talk to our government? Do we talk to you know, the government of Finland because they maybe have the best system in the world, some people say, maybe it's Singapore, where do, where do we go? On the other hand, um, there was another route we decided to go, which was to approach an international education body. Um, the International Baccalaureate uh, is a, is a well-known um, kind of qualification system, uh, almost a movement. And we're delighted that um, John Clawton, who's the uh, development officer for the um, Inter International Baccalaureate Schools and Colleges Association, is, um, is going to be speaking for us.